Olympic short track speed skater Kristen Santos is back home in Connecticut tonight on a tour to promote her sport. News 12 Connecticut Suzanne Goklang spoke to the Fairfield native and her dad about a trip to Beijing that was both exciting and disappointing. Kristen Santos was back on the ice in Shelton tonight, her first time home since the big trip to Beijing. We spoke with the Fairfield native about the Olympic thrills and spills. I can't even get over how excited they are to meet us, how excited we are to meet them. Before she was a big shot, Kristen Santos was just a girl from Fairfield trying her hand at speed skating. I would love to tell people that they should give it a try. Now she's a sight to behold, a world-class athlete and Olympian. One of the frustrating things about our sport, but also one of like the beautiful things about our sport, is that you literally never know what's going to happen. It's going to be Kristen Santos. Kristen headed to Beijing, a U.S. short track favorite. I think in the thousand meters, once I was in that like third position with the lap to go, I kind of tried playing it a little bit more safe, being like, okay, I'm in medal position. The medal she could almost taste vanished. I'm like, oh my God, I think she's going to crash, and then. She did. With more races ahead, Kristen had to focus. Her family, another story. I don't know. I just got up and I, didn't, I don't know. I just didn't know what to say. Well, my family was like so good at like helping me through that more and more focused on making sure that I was okay. Kristen came home without hardware, but her pride, that's intact. As long as I knew that I had done everything I possibly could and put in 100%, like at the end of the day, I couldn't be upset or mad with myself. Kristen says she is hoping to give it another go in four years, but first, a new challenge. She's off to grad school for physical therapy. In Shelton, Suzanne Goldklang, News 12, Connecticut.